We've all known people that daily count their hardships. If you want to have a good life, don't count your hardships, count your blessings. I became aware of one of the very important concepts of life that I had missed before as a young man. And it was my attitude, not my circumstances, was what was making me unhappy. Here's what it says in our Bible. It says in Proverbs 15, verse 15, For the happy heart, life is a continual feast. Well, you and I want a continual feast of life. We want to wake up happy live happy during the day, and go to bed happy. And we can. Happiness does not depend on our outer circumstances, but rather our inner attitudes. When we turn our minds and our thoughts to God and rejoice in God's gifts and give thanks continually, counting our blessings for God's glorious creation, everywhere around us, we're going to experience the joy that God intends for all of God's children. When we dwell only on the negative aspects of life, we often bring needless pain to our friends, to our family, and to ourselves. Do you sincerely want to be a happy person? Then set your mind and your heart on God. And God's love and God's grace will follow you everywhere that you go. Seek a genuine, intimate, life-altering relationship with your Creator by reading God's Word every day, by talking to God, and by trusting in God's promises. And determine right now, to count your blessings instead of counting your hardships. And then you'll know the joy, you'll know the peace, you'll know the spiritual abundance that the shepherd always offers to the sheep. I pray today that you're a happy person. I pray today that you're a magnet for happy things to come into your life.